What if a missile could think for itself? Imagine a weapon so advanced it can circle above the battlefield, find its target on its own, and strike with surgical precision. This isn't science fiction, this is Delilah, Israel's intelligent cruise missile built to hunt moving targets in real time. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into one of Israel's most fascinating defense technologies, the Delilah Smart Cruise Missile. Unlike traditional missiles that simply follow pre-programmed coordinates, Dalila is designed to think, adapt, and hunt. Developed originally by Israel Military Industries and now produced by Elbit Systems, this missile redefined how precision-guided weapons operate on modern battlefields. What makes Delila truly unique is its ability to loiter, meaning it can fly around a target area for an extended time observe through its camera systems, and wait for the right moment to strike. It's not just about destruction, it's about intelligence, timing, and accuracy. In this video, we'll explore how Delilah works, its history, its variants, and how it has changed Israel's strike capabilities forever. So sit tight, by the end of this video, you'll understand why Delilah is often called the missile that thinks. Let's begin by understanding where this smart weapon came from and what inspired its creation. The story of the Delilah missile begins in the 1980s during a period when Israel faced evolving threats that required more flexible precision weapons. Conventional cruise missiles could hit only stationary targets. They couldn't adapt to fast, moving or time-sensitive objectives. The engineers at Israel Military Industries IIMI envisioned something new, a missile that could loiter, observe, and choose when to strike. Initially, Delila was developed as an air launch decoy system designed to mislead enemy air defenses, but the concept evolved quickly. Engineers realized that with guidance and optics upgrades, the same platform could become a lethal precision strike weapon. Over the next decade, they transformed Delilah into a fully capable loitering cruise missile. The weapon was officially revealed in the 1990s, with the Israeli Air Force uh, IAF becoming its first operator. What made it revolutionary wasn't just its range or payload, it was the human in the loop control, allowing an operator to see real time video from the missile's camera, assess targets, and make final strike decisions. This innovation put Israel years ahead in smart munition technology and influenced the design of several future precision guided systems worldwide. At first glance, Delilah may look like a small cruise missile, but beneath its compact body lies a sophisticated fusion of aerodynamics, sensors, and real-time data links. The missile is about 2.7 meters long and carries a 30 kilogram high explosive warhead optimized for pinpoint strikes rather than large scale destruction. Its navigation system combines GPS and inertial navigation, INS, allowing it to maintain precise flight paths even in GPS jammed environments. But its most powerful feature is its electro optical and infrared seeker. Mounted in the nose, this camera feeds live video back to the control operator who can analyze targets in real time. Unlike traditional fire and forget, missiles Delilah can loiter for up to 30 minutes over a target area at speeds of around max 0.5. The operator can manually redirect or abort the strike if civilians or friendly forces are detected, a key ethical advantage. This blend of autonomy and control makes Delilah hybrid between a drone and a missile. It doesn't just fly straight to a pre-set coordinate it thinks dynamically, ensuring every shot counts. Next, let's explore how this unique design is applied across different versions of the Delilah family. Over the years, Israel developed several versions of the Delilah to meet diverse operational needs. The three main variants are Delilah AL, Delilah GL, and Delilah SL. The Delilah AL's air launched version is the most widely known. It's deployed from fighter jets like the F-16 and F-15, giving pilots the ability to strike distant targets without entering enemy airspace. 
Its loitering and optical guidance make it ideal for hitting mobile threats, such as missile launchers or command vehicles. The Delilah GL's ground-launched variant allows for land-based deployment using mobile launchers. This gives the Israeli Defense Forces a versatile option to respond to threats without relying on aircraft. Finally, the Delilah SLC C launch version is integrated on naval vessels. With its range exceeding 250 kilometers, it enables the Israeli Navy to engage coastal or inland targets while maintaining safety offshore. Each version retains the same human in the loop design, offering precision and control unmatched by traditional cruise missiles. This modular flexibility ensures Delilah remains relevant even as battlefield technology evolves. In the next section, we'll see how this missile operates during a real mission from launch to impact. A typical Delilah mission starts with a launch from an aircraft, ground vehicle, or ship. Once airborne, the missile climbs to cruising altitude and follows a pre-programmed flight path using GPS and INS guidance. It can travel hundreds of kilometers, then begin its loitering phase over a designated area. During loitering, its onboard camera begins streaming live footage back to the operator who can view the battlefield in real time. If the target moves or hides, Delilah can circle, adjust altitude, or even pause before diving in. This flexibility is its greatest strength. The operator maintains manual override authority, meaning Delilah never acts independently beyond human control. The moment the target is confirmed, the missile dives sharply and delivers its warhead with extreme accuracy if the situation changes. For example, civilians appear, the operator can cancel the strike or redirect the missile elsewhere. This intelligent decision-making chain minimizes collateral damage and maximizes effectiveness. This combination of loitering capability, live intelligence, and real-time control is what makes Delilah not just another cruise missile, but a thinking weapon. Up next, we'll examine how it has performed in actual combat scenarios. Delilah's combat record demonstrates why it's considered one of Israel's most effective precision weapons. Reports suggest it was first used in the 2006 Lebanon War, where the Israeli Air Force targeted mobile rocket launchers and command posts. Its loitering capability allowed operators to wait for confirmation before striking, avoiding unnecessary civilian harm. Since then, Delilah has likely seen operational use in Syria and other regional conflicts, though official details remain classified. Defense analysts note that its performance consistently showcases Israel's doctrine of precision over power, hitting only what's necessary with surgical accuracy. The missile's real-time video feed also gives commanders valuable intelligence about enemy positions, movement patterns, and terrain effectively turning every launch into an aerial reconnaissance mission. Although combat details are often undisclosed, the system's continued presence in Israel's arsenal for more than two decades speaks volumes about its reliability and adaptability. It's not just a missile, it's a cornerstone of Israel's precision strike network. Next, We'll explore how Delilah compares with other smart cruise missiles around the world and why it still stands out in a crowded field of high-tech weapons. When compared to other precision-guided munitions like the American AGM-158 JSM, the British Storm Shadow, or even the Indian Nurbe, the Israeli Delayla stands out for one reason, control flexibility. Most modern cruise missiles are fire and forget. Once launched, they cannot be redirected mid-flight. Delilah, however, allows the operator to stay connected from start to finish. While its warhead is smaller and range shorter than JSSM or Storm Shadow Delilah's human in, the loop design gives it a tactical edge. It's ideal for dense or dynamic environments where targets move quickly, something traditional missiles struggle with. Moreover, its loitering endurance and real 
time video link make it part drone, part missile, an unusual hybrid in modern warfare. Few countries have achieved this level of integration between missile guidance, autonomy, and pilot control. This combination gives Israel an asymmetric advantage, the ability to conduct surgical strikes with minimal collateral risk. In many ways, Delilah bridges the gap between unmanned aerial vehicles and conventional cruise missiles, representing a new era of precision strike warfare. Next, we'll see how technology from Delilah inspired other Israeli defense innovations that continue shaping the global arms industry. Delilah's success didn't just end with its own deployment, it sparked a wave of innovation in Israeli defense technology. Many systems that followed, like the Rampage missile, Harop loitering munition, and Skystriker drone, drew inspiration from Delilah's core principle, precision through control. The integration of real, time data links and electro, optical seekers became a defining feature of Israeli weapons development. This approach influenced not only air launch systems, but also ground and naval precision munitions. Globally, several nations studied Delilah's architecture as a model for future loitering or semi-autonomous missiles. It effectively blurred the line between cruise missiles and UAVs, proving that one weapon could perform both surveillance and strike roles. Elbit Systems continues to refine this legacy, incorporating AI-based image recognition and autonomous decision support tools in newer systems. The DNA of Delilah can be seen across multiple Israeli platforms that focus on smart engagement and reduced collateral impact. In short, Delilah wasn't just a weapon, it was a blueprint for an entire generation of smart munitions. Next, let's look at the technical specifications that define this remarkable missile's capabilities. Here's a closer look at what makes Delilah such a capable weapon in terms of pure numbers and engineering. A length approximately 2.7 meters a wingspan, weight 5 meters, weight roughly 187 kilograms, warhead 30 kaigaji high, explosive fragmentation to range up to 250 kilometers speed, around max 0.50, subsonic guidance, GPS, gay, uh, INS, electro, optical seeker, uh, control human, in the loop reel, time video feed, deloiter time, up to 30 minutes, e, launch platforms, air, ground, and see each of these specifications serves a purpose. The lightweight body enhances maneuverability, while the moderate speed allows stable video transmission during loitering. The compact warhead reduces collateral risk, making Delilah ideal for precision engagements in urban or complex terrains. Its modular design means maintenance and upgrades are easy. Israel has improved its software and sensors over time without needing a complete redesign. In essence, every number in these specs tells a story of smart engineering for smarter warfare. Now, let's conclude by understanding why Delilah remains a critical part of Israel's defense strategy even decades after its debut. Delilah is more than a missile. It's a symbol of Israel's commitment to precision intelligence and technological superiority. In a region where threats can appear and disappear quickly, the ability to strike accurately without causing unnecessary damage is invaluable. For Israel, Delilah bridges the gap between tactical flexibility and strategic restraint. It allows the military to neutralize threats deep inside enemy territory without escalating conflict or endangering pilots. Its real time control system ensures accountability, precision, and ethical engagement, setting a standard for modern warfare. Even as newer missiles emerge, Delilah continues to evolve with better optics, improved guidance, and AI-assisted targeting. Its design philosophy, observe, decide, strike, remains the foundation for Israel's future precision weapons. This missile's enduring relevance shows how innovation, not just firepower, defines modern military success. Delilah is not the loudest or the fastest weapon, but it's among the smartest ever built. If you found this deep dive into Israel's Delilah missile fascinating, make sure to like, share, and subscribe for more in-depth analyses of advanced defense technologies. 
Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss our next episode on the world's most innovative military systems.